what has been the most exciting project that you have worked on? The one I'm going to bring up is I-476, what they call the Blue Route, to make uh, displays for the people, for the public and all. They'll a lot of times use a colored tape to approximate a line on top of an aerial photograph. And that's what they had done there. They had a yellow line, a red line, and a blue line. And the blue route was the one that was originally selected. It basically followed two creek valleys mm -hmm. through, or two watersheds through Delaware County um, because it had the, the least amount of impact on the local roads, the least amount of impact on the residential, which if you're familiar with Delaware County is very densely populated. It was a challenge because now you're going through environmentally sensitive areas that were subject to a lot of lawsuits and a lot of people watching to make sure that you were protecting the environment during construction. My first three days with Urban was practicing for the presentation before PennDOT to get the Blue Roof. Urban was hired as the construction manager for I-476. The whole concept of construction management as it exists at PennDOT was really, I, I think, a, a you know, a formulation of Joe McAtee and, and Al Alberts and work that they had done on the Schuylkill Expressway project. There were six different construction contracts and they basically, we started construction on the first one in the fall of 87 and the last one started in June of 88, uh, but they all basically had to get done at the same time because to open the whole thing you had to have them all done. So there was a lot of coordination that way as far as keeping each one on schedule and did this one affect that one. Some of the rock on the job when it was exposed started to decompose rapidly. The department ended up actually re-examining the pavement structures and everything uh, and a lot of the structures out there are sitting now on a, a bed of concrete that wasn't in the original design just to cap the softer rock when it would start to decompose. Harry Talley was head of the highway department back then. Harry Talley was probably the most dedicated individual. When we were doing the Blue Route, he would wake up in the middle of the night and he'd say, oh my God, something is not right. He would get up in the middle of the night, right out to the Blue Route, and check what was out there to make sure that what he was doing was was correct. This is the this is the way Harry Talley was.